So I just had a great session with somebody and I wanted to tell you about it. Uh, I worked on this mom. I worked on her at her house. She was a new mom and she had a newborn and then she had a four-year-old. And the four-year-old is the cutest thing ever, right? She's precocious. She talked a lot. She danced around in her ballerina outfit. But the, throughout the session, I worked on her mom's back. And she kept asking me, the four-year-old kept saying, I want to get on the table. Can I get on the table? I want to get on the table. I need work. I need work. I need to get on the table. I need work. And the mom kept saying, no, 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 stop. You're bugging Miss Julie. You leave her alone. You're bugging her. Just leave her alone. You don't need work. You're fine. And so once we got done, I looked at the little girl and I said, honey, what do you need? What, what hurts? What hurts you? And she says, my feelings are hurt. She says, my feelings are hurt. I need you to work on my feelings, which blew me away because you guys, that's so profound. The majority of clients that you have are not being heard. They're not being heard. They're being dismissed, which is what we did with this little girl for an hour. And their feelings are hurt. So remember, you're not just working on people's bodies. You're working on their feelings as well. So when you are working on your clients, listen to them. They have a lot of information to give you more than just their symptoms. I hope this helps.